You won't be going to no more parties with no little girls with no edges because you know you like girls with no edges. You are never... Yeah, but didn't you say she ain't had no edges? Girls grinding on you is not live. You're going you gonna to make me throw you up against the wall. And what you think about Karuchi? He's fine. Karuchi fine? Yeah. Oh, this little boy needs Jesus. So K. Michelle from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta has a son that's out here having thoughts grind on him. And he's, what, maybe 10 or 11 or something like that? I mean, this kid, I don't even think he's 13 years old yet. He has these hoes over here twerking it and working it for him. And to make matters more interesting, they have no damn edges. <laughs> Guess you can save on here, Joe, or our, however, these whores are keeping their edges looking fleeky, trying to get those baby hairs, as the hood whores call it. Wow, this is just shameful. But he does have good taste and good tasting women because he does think that Karushi is fine. That's my little blazing treat right there. Shout out to Karushi. But anyways, man, I just had to share this with you guys. This is so interesting. I mean, here we have K. Michelle, the crazy reality TV star, having a seemingly random conversation with her son just about some old crazy mess. I mean, how would you react to your son who's under the age of 13 with thoughts grinding on him, essentially giving him standing lap dances up here, shaking their butts and whatnot, being nasty? And then to top it off, they don't have any GD edges. Somewhere in the mirror brushing their scalp. Talking about they're brushing their hair. And they don't have any hair. This little bald-headed heffles. How would you feel about your son who's under the age of 13 having some bald-headed, no-edge-having heifers over there grinding on him at parties and whatnot? And what do you think about Karuchi? Do you think that she's fine? Now, I don't know little man's name, but I think Karuchi's fine. And he thinks Karuchi's fine. But you know who else I think is fine too? K. Michelle. And this, now this selfie right here is reassulous. I mean, ridiculous. I, I mean, geez. And it's ridiculous too. I mean, uh, but geez. But anyways, man. Shout out to K. Michelle for looking so damn fleeky. I mean, that right there is crazy. And now she said that she got an ass reduction. And it looked like she went and got an ass refill. I mean, that booty looks as big as ever. I mean, damn. She looks like she has to have specially made chairs. I mean, I don't know what's crazier, K. Michelle or that ass. But anyways, just because I think K. Michelle's banging, just because I think Karushi is fine as hell, just because I agree with K. Michelle's son, just because I think he's a mess already, that's definitely K. Michelle's son right there. Young as hell, thoughts grinding on him, already basically ladies, man. And he wants the world to know, Karushi is fine. But anyways, what do you think about all this? Is this video funny? Or are you offended that her son has girls grinding on him with no damn edges? I mean, did they get the edges snatched? I mean, did Beyonce do it? I mean, that bitch is good for snatching edges. I mean, what do you guys think about this, man? About him with the thoughts grinding and the no edge having ass thoughts? The, the crush on Karushi? The fact that Gay Michelle seems as if she's concerned but not really upset? I mean, is she making fun of the situation? Is she being too lighthearted about it? Or do you think that she's on point with the way that she's handling things? Or do you think she should have whooped his ass? She should have made like one of her Facebook videos and popped that with the belt and whooped that ass. Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. My son would be grounded. I give him a high five for the crew. She is fine comment. But I would tell him like this. No thoughts grinding on you, especially if they have no edges. Meat Magazine.